Hey everyone, I'm Lorenzo and in this video I'm going to talk about the two brothers in ARMS games for the Nintendo Wii. The two brothers in ARMS games on the Wii are like the Call of Duty games for the Wii, but much much worse. I was talking in the old Call of Duty games for Wii video how the controls feel awkward. Well, the Call of Duty games were amazing compared to the two brothers in ARMS games. Imagine the two games like this. Call of Duty's weird motion controls and some brain dead AI slept on top. Brothers in Arms on the Xbox was a tactical game, you could command your squad. Then on the PS2 it had AI issues when it was ported. And the makers of the Wii version, 3 years later, decided that it was a good idea to take the faulty version of the PS2 game, slap motion controls over it without fixing the game first and voila. Some bad games were bo- Even the dude on the cover art is crying. And as Mark Bozen, a reviewer at IGN says, you are not fighting only the Germans, you are also babysitting every member of your crew. And then, what can be worse, you could ask, you could ask yourself. Well, the game has frame rate issues too. And then, what could be worse, you could ask yourself. Well, the games have frame rate issues too. And not only this, but the games freeze too, for some seconds, in some portions. The games are still playable, and the issues I mentioned about the AI and the freezes, even if they don't occur constantly, they still occur often enough to notice them. In rest, the core of the game is awesome, it's an action-packed World War II shooter, with nice level designs. But as a conclusion, the games, even if they are not broken, the frame rate issues and the awkward controls encourages me to recommend you play the games only on other platforms than on the Wii. They are great games, but not on the Wii.